forecast. Well, beautiful weather today, getting a little bit warm out there, but uh, you know our temperatures this afternoon are just about normal. Now, over the next couple of days, they'll become above normal and get closer and closer to records by the weekend. Let's take a quick look out from the Skyview camera in uh, Fresno. As you can see, clear skies. Even the mountains are clear right now. No showers or thunderstorms. Similar looking view from Visalia and the Grapevine. That camera is actually looking back north toward the valley, so we're kind of on the other side of the uh, grapevine there, and that's the Skyview camera in Yosemite looking at Half Dome and clear and mild there too. 88 degrees in Visalia currently with a high temperature reported today of 90 degrees in uh, that city, and most other locations were either in the middle 80s up north around Merced and Modesto to the upper 80s, Fresno at 89, low 90s or 90, Porterville, Visalia, Visalia Hanford, and Lemoore as well. So it was a uh, very warm day, but a typically warm day for us. Wind from the northwest up to about 12 miles per hour, and now we look at high pressure moving in for the next several days, so things will get a little bit uncomfortable out there. Tonight, skies are clear all across central California. The clouds and showers have left moving across um, Utah right now, and the warming trend on the way. So as that uh, little bit of moist air and cooler air leaves us, high pressure comes in from the west that kind of shuts down the sea breeze, and it should boost temperatures up to about 10, 12 degrees above the normal for this time of year. Out here, there's a cool low pressure system that will make very slow progress to us. It will take until Monday to really notice this thing kind of wearing out this high pressure ridge. So we're counting on that to come in and bring some cooling air to us by the end of the weekend, early next week. And if you want to connect with us at any time, please do so. Let us know how you're doing in the hot temperatures. Maybe take some pictures of, I don't know, your brown grass, the bright sun. Think of something, some flowers maybe that need some water. Connect on Facebook, CBS 47 Fresno, at Scott Mace 47 on Twitter. And of course, you can just send us an email as well. There's not a lot to see on the forecast here. Skies mostly clear, a couple of high clouds coming through tomorrow afternoon and Friday afternoon, but uh, look Looks like we're in for a lot of sunshine and very, very warm high temperatures. Air quality is moderate, Fresno and, K and Tulare County. It's, it's good in Kings, Madera and Merced County for tonight. Low temperatures tonight will drop down to the middle 50s. Chowchilla about 54, Merced 53. Highs tomorrow, upper 80s to around 90. Again, about normal for this time of year, honestly. Um, and then uh, things will warm up after that even more. 56 in Selma tonight. In Lemoore, 57. Highs tomorrow, 95 in Hanford and 94 in Huron. In Visalia, the low will drop to 56, and the high temperature tomorrow should make it up to 91 degrees. Three River at 92 and 65 or so around Lodgepole and Ponderosa. And those higher elevations will be in the 30s tonight, 60s and 70s for tomorrow. About the only place you can escape the heat. Uh, even Yosemite Valley at 90 for tomorrow afternoon, 88 in Oakhurst. And here's the high Sierra forecast with your weekend in view. Looks uh, pretty warm out there. Clear skies, 73 Friday, 76 Saturday, up to about uh, 80 or so as we wrap up the weekend. So a very warm seven-day forecast with only cooling next week. 58 degrees tonight in Fresno, a light breeze out there tomorrow, 92 high clouds come through in the afternoon, but really don't cut down the temperature too much. And check out this seven day forecast with your weekend of you 95 degrees on Friday, 98 Saturday and I have 94 on Sunday. So warming trend right through the uh, end of the weekend and then slightly cooler temperatures for next week. If you want to see that forecast again, you can always check it out on our website, yourcentralvalley.com. You can see the regional video forecast while you're there as well. So, yeah, getting a little bit hot out there. The grass is going to suffer. Yeah. We're going to suffer a little bit. Uh, hopefully, we'll see a cooling trend with that bigger low coming through next yeah. week, and it'll stick around for a while. Let's hope so. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Scott. <laughs> well, splashing around on a water slide is a great way to cool off, but the drought is having an impact on One Valley Entertainment Center. Find out what's being done to conserve water. Plus, some triplets from Newport Beach will be seeing a lot more of each other. We have the details about the prestigious.